Let's try and shoot that. I need to make this platform like more smooth. Okay, let's try. Let's try. <laughs> I want to build a platform. <laughs> How's going through this is happy days and welcome back to our expert spirit mod. Let's play. And guys, I'm so excited to get into the action today. As you can see, we are taking on the lunatic cultists. We are officially starting the end game of the spirit mod. And I'm very excited to see what lies in store for us. And our big decision, I suppose, is... Ah! Not, not, not to die, firstly. Um, our big decision is going to be which of the... Oh my gosh, Happy, did I hit the right one? I think my uh, summons did. Um, which of the uh, pillars we're going to fight first? So, like, which uh, weapons do we want to get? And I'm not quite sure. I think we'll have a little, a little think during the fight and see what we want to go for. I mean, sometimes uh, one of the pillars spawns right on top of us. Okay, where is it? Where's the angry one? Beautiful, we got it. And we definitely need a bit of a weapon power up, so we will be looking into that. As you can see, I also got a new Atlas summon weapon, uh, because I had to fight Atlas again to get some more stuff to make- Ah, I'm dying! No, happy, no, don't die! No! Okay, we're flying, I'm in the UFO, we're going for it. Oh, did I get it? I don't think I did. Oh no, now the dragon's out. Oh, this is keeps getting worse. How long have you healed? Oh, I should probably put my buffs on. Oh my goodness, Happy. What are you doing, you crazy chicken? I thought I put them on. No. How long have you healed? How long are two seconds? We can do this, people. Oh, you just got to leave. All right, there we go. We got it. Get some nice hits in. Lovely. All right. I think I need to refresh my summons. Okay, let's get these up. Quick, quick. Summons for days. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, I had to stop moving for a second, but it's all good. Oh, goodness. Anyway, guys, I am also excited because we are just about to start our new series. So today is the last day you can get your suggestions in for our next adventure. Um, and then in tomorrow's Dante episode, oh my gosh, where is it? In tomorrow's Dante episode, we'll actually have the voting up. So I'm very excited about all of that. And oh my gosh, don't die, Happy. You're so close. No, don't lightning me. Oh, goodness. Okay, we've got hearts going. We've got honey for Happy. It's all happening. All right, let's get it. It's so close to dying. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We're going to get it. Yes, come on. Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, oh. oh hey, what's that guy? Hello? What are you? Are you a new NPC? Thank you for pardoning me. You're a kind soul. Did he just come out of the cultist? What? Oh my gosh. Ancient guidance. Holy moly. That thing's insane. Whoa. Look at the damage. Okay. Uh, Elder Weave Scarf. Oh my gosh. Let's just get this stuff. What's this? Heart of the Moon? Oh, look at all this. I want to buy it all. Am I going to use it all? A dagger, magic bullet, what can't it do? 38 range damage. I just went to all this effort to make the chlorified pouch. Oh, fate token. <gasps> Goodness. Okay, we've got to get this guy to move into our base. I really want to try these magic bullets though, so let's buy a stack of them now. Um, I don't think they work with this gun, so I'll have to get a normal gun as well. And are we near a pillar? Let's see. I'm not seeing a pillar near us. Let's go for a little stroll and see if there's one nearby. Hello, pillars. Pillars. Oh, hang on. No, this is just corruption by him. Anyway, guys, we'll get back to base. Hopefully, it's not filled up with our pillars, and we'll plan our next move. So here we are. It's a nice new day. We're at Devon's beautiful house near the beach, and the slime is running around. And I thought, I was looking at the Atlas armor upgrade, which is what I want to make next. And uh, it actually gives a bonus to melee uh, damage. So I thought that would be really cool uh, if we fight the solar pillar first, uh, which is just nearby, I believe. It should be very close now, even though we're probably going to get smashed. Oh, it's got like a boss bar. Oh my gosh, how does this work? Okay, let's get our, um, let's get some sentry magic attacks up. No, crawl to pain. No, this went zero to 100 very quickly. Ooh. Okay, there we go. It's all under control, people. I'm not going to die instantly. No, no. Don't kill me! I don't want to die straight away! Okay, there we go. I'm gonna hide under here. Oh, leave me alone! Oh, is this a sword shrine? No! It's a sword shrine! Oh. Think you're so smart, don't you, Fault Solar Pillar? Oh my gosh, I'm Queen Bee Arena ring again! No, Happy, just get the pillars up here. I mean, the platforms, you know what I mean? Oh, goodness, this is the worst stairway ever. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. At least I'm off the ground. No, I dashed. Oh, all right, get back up to the beautiful platform. We're going to live, guys. We're going to live. Oh, this is a travesty. I haven't played. I haven't done the, the pillars forever. No, leave me alone. I'm going to hide in the water. No. Oh, leave me alone. Oh. 
Okay, okay, we're gonna be alright. We're gonna live. It's all under control. Let's get up here. Beautiful. Let's attack this guy. Nice. I need a campfire. Let's get some nice healing down. Quick, where can I put the campfire? There's no empty space. There we go. Ah, ah, beautiful. I can't put it down. Oh. Alright, worm, get out of the way. I want my nice campfire. Ah. Okay, so we almost died, but we didn't. That's nice. All right, so we're going to make our way back up. No, Grolda Bean! Were you just waiting for me? Ooh! Okay, I've got a shiny stone. It's all right. We'll get a shiny stone on. We'll get some healing. We'll get that slimy. It's all under control. There we go. Let's try and shoot that. I need to make this platform, like, more smooth. Okay, let's try. Let's try. I want to build a platform. No! Ooh! Alright, so I think I'll just try and YOLO and make it as far as I can. No, just stop killing me! <laughs> okay, guys, I think I've got it worked out. Like, there's like this area here, right? So you run down the bridge and they kind of get stuck on that little bit there, kind of. Um, so that gives me a little bit of reprieve. See how they're getting stuck there? And I'm putting like the summons in here and then they're going to eat them. So that's going to be like 100% foolproof. Oh. So then all I need to do is I run back up my perfect bridge, best in the world. And then I just sort of like do a bit of a loop-to-loop -loop and lure a few more over. And that should hopefully work. <laughs> well, I'm not instantly dying for once, which is kind of nice. And then, like, the Selenian things aren't as bad either. So I can actually use some ranged attacks. So I think I've finally got this under control. So let's zoom ahead to when I've finally got this pillar beaten. Oh, my gosh. I've seen the uh, pillar's uh, health meter come up, which means it might be party time, guys. No, nope, we're just going to yolo for the win. Why did a crawler beat have to show up? Oh, no. Okay, where's this pillar? Come on. We can make it. Let's get that crawler beat out of the way. And let's get the summon things on it. Uh, goodness okay there we go oh i'm so dead no yes they're like still hurting the pillar i might still win yes woo, woo, woo. oh yes it actually worked ah. your mind goes numb so those like magic attacks actually killed it after i died that's so awesome let's go see how many uh thingies we got Yes, fragments for happy. Very nice indeed. How many do we get? 40? That's actually not too bad. And, and a tombstone. <laughs> anyway, let's wait for morning and we'll do some crafting. I'm so excited. Are you two going to be nice friends, huh? <laughs> I found this <laughs> in all the chaos. It seems like something dropped. I don't know if it dropped from an enemy or whatever, but it's a new mount. And uh, yeah, it's kind of cool. Like, it can't double jump or anything. But uh, yeah, it like, leaves a little flame trail behind it. It's kind of cool. I like it. But I'll probably stick with my UFO for now. But it is time for us to do a bit of powering up. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. So I put all my solar stuff on there. Uh, so the first thing I want to do is... I got some more of those arcane geysers so what we should be able to craft oh my goodness where is the armor set here it is guys uh so it's called primal stone uh and it's based off of the atlas boss i'm pretty excited i'm loving all these armor sets so far so let's get that equipped Oh my gosh, and I'll take the helmet off. It looks like my head's exploding. What's going on here? My head's like on fire. Oh, my head. And what's the set bonus? Melee and magic hits on enemies trigger unstable affliction. Enemies suffering uh, different effects, blah de blah Reduces your movement speed. What's with this reduces movement speed business? Um, melee, so you get big damage buffs, which is kind of good, and my head's going to explode. Uh, also, I want to make the solar eruption and the daybreak and i'll throw some nice modifiers on that oh they're actually not too bad to start with that's actually kind of good so what we'll do is let's put our nice armor on one of the mannequins and let's see there's an empty one there we'll put our nice illuminant set on that so guys i'm going to grab some buff potions and what we might do is just speed through the next two pillars uh, and get ready for the moon lord Oh my goodness, guys. This was like 3 million times easier than the uh, solar pillar was. Like, they literally were just getting caught in the ponds on the side of me. And all I had to do was use my solar eruption. So, not complaining about that at all. Especially after how many times I died in the solar pillar. But, Happy, don't die at the end here. Oh, no, 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 no. no! Please don't kill me. No, I was just gloating how easy it was. Oh, there we go. It's all out of control. Oh, goodness. All right. Let's kill these last few ones. Beautiful. Stop respawning. There we go. Very nice. And we'll get some nice icy essences. We'll get some vortex fragments. Ah, 
All right, I think we'll do... Oh, that's a good amount. And oh, I see essences. You can make even more stuff with it. Oh, wow. There's so much to explore. Holy moly. Uh, I think we'll do the uh, nebula pillar next. Let's go. Okay, here we go guys. Nebula wasn't too bad. It was a little bit harder than Vortex, but uh, that's mostly just because of the teleporting enemies. But uh, for the most part, it went pretty nicely indeed. So let's just clear up these last few mobs and let's not die in the process. Nice, let's get rid of those. And let's get some nice fragments for Happy. <gasps> I'm in the spirit biome, oh my gosh. Okay, let's make sure the spirit triangle thingy doesn't kill me. Okay, there we go, beautiful. Let's kill a few of those. All right guys, it's time to plan our next move. Nightmare fuel? What on earth is that? I've just come down into the dungeon because we haven't been here and oh my gosh there's even more stuff and no is that a sniper no sniper no don't kill me oh goodness i'm right, throwing the buffs on um yeah i've made it oh my gosh what is that shooting the red things no don't shoot the red things at happy ah it's chasing me now oh goodness it's like it's like a red dinosaur thing oh yeah i was checking out some of the end game crafting recipes and they seem to require ectoplasm uh, so I thought we'd make our way down here and just pick up any last minute sort of things because the next episode uh, of Devon series will be the finale. Oh, what did we just find? A Fellbinder. Oh, 159 melee damage. Oh, that is cool. We got Dungeon Spirit. I can drink the Dungeon Spirit? Oh my goodness, what on earth is that? I got a Swan Helmet. This is all happening, people. Oh, but I'm so excited for Devon's finale. So make sure you get any tips and tricks in, like anything you think we'll need. Uh, for the Overseer boss fight because it's going to be pretty full on. I'm very excited for it. And uh, yeah, I'll do a little bit of grinding as well to get any other equipment that we might need for the battle. So I haven't found too much ectoplasm so far. But as always, the dungeon is super hard <laughs> after playing Terra on expert mode. What are those block things? There's like blocks that are alive in here. Oh my goodness. And these green things aren't good either. Oh, and there's like a baby skeleton. We found a ghoul fire. Oh, wow. There's, oh, there's so much stuff. That looks even stronger. Oh, wow. Look at all this stuff. Man, I am going to have to do a little bit of farming down here and get some of these materials so we can just make a bunch of cool stuff. But uh, yeah, anyway, guys, uh, make sure you get your suggestions in for our next series. We'll be doing the voting in tomorrow's Dante video. So very excited about that. Really looking forward to starting a new series again. Let's pick up an alchemy table. Why not? Super pumped about it. So look, we will start to wrap that up there for today because I want to save all the fun stuff for our last Devon episode. We've got a lot to do still. Fighting the Moon Lord. Then we'll power up and fight the Overseer. And then we'll have a bit of fun like we always do at the end of our series. So guys, smash the like button if you're enjoying our Devon adventure. I'm so pleased we're finishing this series. Um, you know, it's been going on for a while, but it's been a very fun series at the same time. Subscribe if you want to see more content from me. And don't forget to check out our second channel. We've got our Cuphead adventure going on down there. And here's the most important part. As always, you'll stay happy and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Days signing out. See ya!